Okay, folks, we're going to be on my last MC character. And we're going to go ahead and pick somebody up from the airport.
ready to go grab Luna Bell? Mm hmm. I'll get up on my bike. You saw what happened to my other bike? Oh, shit. Yeah, I heard about it. Yeah, I gotta we'll fix it. Ah, uh, that sucks. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. I'm gonna, I've got some ideas on how to fix it up and make it different. And this way, at least I'm riding this one again. You want to take the interstate? Uh, Probably be quicker. Yeah, that'll be quicker. So I probably fudged a little with a quorum of two, but <laughs> congrats Wait, on we're, VP. We're, we're, <laughs> we only had two for the meet in church yesterday, the other day. Yeah, sorry, apologies about that. Ah, uh, no problem, man. Evie couldn't make it either, so. Wait a minute, why are we going this way? We could have just taken a... We're getting on interstate. We're turning here. Oh, okay. No, but we, we, we still could have gotten them down there, couldn't we? No, you gotta go like two exits down. Ah. Uh, because the where we were at is that bridge up ahead. You can't get on the highway from there. Oh yeah, right. So we would have had to go like almost a pillbox to get on the interstate. Of course this is gonna want us to run through the the, the thing, so we're gonna take the highway here. And then take this one. So anyways, I happen found out what happened to the baby. She had a miscarriage. Oh shit, really? Yep. That explains why we haven't seen Comrade around. Oh. Well, yeah, she went She went on a world tour, so she just got back in town. I was gonna try to get her patch, but there wasn't enough members to push that through. I wasn't gonna do that with two people. Yeah, we can do that another time anyways. That's what I figured, because I figured you wouldn't be opposed to it. But in the meantime, I'm gonna sponsor her, so she's got a sponsor. Since we wanna what? make it so that every, all the pat prospects have to have a sponsor. We're gonna get over in the other lane. One thing we need to get figured out is getting a clubhouse up in the county again. That would be love. I love it. I prefer to be in the county, truthfully. I mean, shit, we can... Oh, wait. <laughs> Actually, I think we should have taken that exit. Oh, well. Oh, well, we can still keep going straight anyways. <laughs> yeah, I think there's another exit up here anyways. Yeah, I was a bit confused. I don't come down here too often, so... I don't either, truthfully. I prefer the city. Yeah, we can take this next exit. I mean, couldn't we just kept going down and then there's like an exit to go directly into the airport? I think, I don't know. But the GPS didn't want to leave me there, so. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, it's down here anyway, so. Yeah, so I think we just have to follow this.
I think she's at the first terminal. So, uh... so up here? Yeah, I think so. If not, we gotta swing around the bottom. Oh. <laughs> She must be on the lower level. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. There she is. Hello. Howdy. You remember Captain Skittles, I'm sure? Of course I do. Well, he's the new VP. We gotta go at one of our Is he now? Okay. Yeah, so you got sure. picked up by the VP and the Prez. Oh, it's nice to see you back. Uh, it's good to be back. Shit, nice hair too. Yeah, looks like you've been taking care of yourself. <laughs> oh shit, he has a. <laughs> I have no hair. <laughs> Same old days. Uh, uh, I, don't, I am never riding an airplane ever again. Well, hopefully you'll stay on two wheels from now on. Most of my trip I did, but to get back, I was like, yeah, I might as well just take this. Mm. You getting your bike shipped over, or you're going to have to get a new one? Mm, I'm debating on it. Okay. I have a few friends over there they are watching it right now. Okay. Well, in the meantime, once I get my other bike fixed, you can uh, borrow that one. But I got to get the other one fixed first. I ran into a deer the other night. God oh, damn it. Do you want to stop by the clubhouse and get your uh, prospect jacket on, or do you want to head straight to my place? Doesn't matter to me. Let's get her in a proper jacket. What do you think, VP? Yeah. That seems like a good uh, good excuse it's to go back good. to the clubhouse. Yep, it's good to have you back, Luna Bell. Shit, we got it synced up like that. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, let me put set a GPS marker for the return. Yeah, shit, give, give me the postal. Yeah, well, it's seventy two ninety nine. You know, we should really have it memorized. Do we want to take the streets or the highway again? Shh, highway, I ain't dealing with no traffic lights. <laughs> yeah. How was your flight? Horrible. Well, at least you're back. You fly in straight from Japan then? Yep. It's really beautiful. You should see it sometime. Yeah, I'll take your word for it. I'm not much of a, a plane person myself. I prefer boats. But they take forever. take the highway exit here otherwise we're getting on the road I hate the city we lost our county clubhouse Sam had to board it up and sell it because of uh, money situations. I'm 
mainland, as long as we have one, it should be good. Yeah, we got the one in the city still. But me and me and uh, Captain Skittles both prefer the county one. <laughs> oh, I do too. Why do you think I live out in the middle of nowhere? You both know where I live. Oh, by the way, we're going to have a Memorial Day party at my place. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, well, that's good. Yeah, Get we're going to ride. Fireworks again. Yeah, we're going to have a ride. We're going to ride out from the clubhouse to my place and then have a barbecue. Shit, that's going to be good. Yeah, that's what I figured. Uh, we need to take this exit here. <sighs> Told you the GPSs are crap. Yeah, I know, given they uh, don't really like overlapping roads for some reason. Mm -hmm. and, and they especially don't like it when you're uh, traveling short the roads. Figure we go back the way we came practically. We gotta get over. I'm almost out of gas, actually. <laughs> my thing chugs gas, I'll tell you. Oh, both of these do. Okay, Shit, let's ga get her a jacket. That was at like 60 before we left. I still gotta get my concealed yeah, carry permit at some point in time. Yeah. I think I still have my grandfathered one. Pretty sure. I heard you have to do, had to do them all new. Oh, okay, shit, really? let me go cool. grab the list with the uh, numbers. Well, at least I didn't get caught with one then. <laughs> I don't know if it's still valid, but uh, if I remember correctly, before I left, I had a felony, so. I need to hide this. Mm, probably a good idea. That or. I figured since, you know, I've been away and, you know, I've been on good terms, like I didn't do anything bad for many years. Why can't I just get it pulled out of my record, you know? I don't know. You're going to have to take that up with the county. But they are, I guess, a bit difficult to work with sometimes. Okay, uh, that's gonna be locker number 387 or 386, your choice. And I uh, emailed you the other information. Right. I'll be back here if you wanna go put it on. I'll unlock this door if you wanna change in there.
Yeah, so it was me and uh, Ruby Ridge, or whatever his name is, uh, were the only two patch members for the open house. Uh, how many people came? Uh, we actually got two hangarounds, which was the main objective of that in the first place. So on that aspect of things, it was good. Um, we also had two prospects that haven't showed up in a while. Um, if you looked at the roster recently, you'll see that there's two prospects now that have dates next to their name. They still need sponsors because I want to make it that every prospect has a sponsor. And the sponsor will determine when they're ready to be a patch member, I think, would be the best way. What do you think or not? Hmm. We're getting sponsors from patch members? Huh. Well. Well, sponsors sponsor have patch members sponsor prospects, basically. Shit, that doesn't sound like a bad idea. So the, the sort of step into the club would be you start out as a hangaround for a month or so. Uh, and then one of the patch members have to sponsor you. And that sponsor will teach, the if they get voted in as a prospect, that sponsor will teach the prospect the ways of the club. And once, that, once they somebody feels that they're ready to be patched, then either the sponsor or somebody else can bring that up. And then they get pro uh, brought up, you know what I mean? Um, so the only downside to that is we'll be limiting how many new prospects we can have at a time since currently we only have a handful of patch members. Which is one of the reasons I like to get Luna Mel patched as soon as possible. I mean, one, you know, she was a, as active as I was back in the day. I don't know what happened after I left state, but quite frankly, it sounds like most people stopped being around after I left state, so... I'm not holding that against anybody. Um, we've had a couple people show interest at prospects. We had two prospects, David Blaze and uh, Mortimer Knox or something like that. They showed up for the open house. Um, our new prospect showed up for the open house. So we actually had three prospects and two patch members for the open house. Nice. Now we just got to get you patched. Mm -hmm. Fortunately, we didn't have a good enough church like I was telling uh, Dom here. We only had two members show up for church last time. I was pushing it, making him VP. And uh, Evie Tracy, I don't know if you know Evie Tracy from the old days. Mm -hmm. She knows Sam. She's back as well. She's our treasurer. Dom here is the VP. I'm the prez. Sam. Sam's still a member, but she uh, is out of state currently. I don't know if we're going to be seeing her much at all. We're going to rebuild and leave our outlaw ways behind and become an honest club that is part of the community. I mean, to begin with, we weren't really doing much outlaw stuff anyway. So. I know. Well, that's why I figured we might as well just distance ourselves from that because it definitely looked like that was keeping people from joining us too. Shit, even the last big... I don't know if you're around for this one, but... Uh, shit, that was like ages ago. We did some real f uh, fucked up thing. I don't remember what it was, but... It involved fire, so... No, not fire as in the mm. department, but, you know... Fire as in burning shit? Mm-hmm. Not saying we won't bend any laws or anything like that. I mean... Running other lives when there's no cops around, no no yeah. cop, no stop sort of thing. That's yeah, still valid. speeding. That's all still valid. It ain't ain't gonna be like we're gonna be up bottle standing citizens that aren't gonna do anything. But you know, drug running, all the other crap. I think it's time to put that in the past. I mean, we can always table it and bring it back later once we're nice, big, and strong, and have cleaned up our reputation so the cops aren't looking at us. Because the problem right now, if we do anything or even remotely or anything you know no the cops are all over us every single freaking time yeah they always are so but what's your thoughts on that luna yeah well from what i remember even though we uh, uh when i was here um you always view us as you know uh I guess it's some sort of gang. And 
We weren't, but to them, they see how many numbers of us. Remember, because, you know, they, they yeah. see a group of us, they have to call back yet, like we're going to do something. Yeah. Well, we're going to do some things to fix that. One of the things I want to do, you're a mechanic, I'm a mechanic. I want to start teaching motorcycle, basic maintenance of motorcycle at the clubhouse. We could even host the first few classes for free and then maybe start charging people for them if they want to pay. Wouldn't be a lot, but enough to cover some expenses. Um, I was actually thinking of doing motorcycle riding training. Which would also help us because if people learn how to ride a motorcycle, they might actually get a real motorcycle and join the club. And I wouldn't mind redoing the uh, Toys for Tots drive, ro drive we did the one time. But I think that's going to wait till later. Yeah, we don't have enough members for that. Yeah, we want to have a nice strong showing. But that's all stuff I'd like to do at some point in time. Um, so, I'll say this much. We've got more active members currently than we did two months ago. So, And I don't know when next church is, but uh, it'll probably be in. I'm guess, I don't know if we even want to try a third church in May. You know what I mean? I don't think that's going to work out too good. Yeah. I mean, we try, or for churches, we should be a bit more flexible about dates. It's just like... Well, like, that's why many... I asked everybody to say what day works best for them. I'd like to set pick a day um, and try to stick with it one, every month, basically. That way people try, know when it's happening. I, try to do, I think weekends would be great, but depends that's on what which weekends. Well, like Saturday, you know, maybe Saturday you saw seems the, a bit... You saw the poll in the thing. Put the days you put any days you think would work would work for you. That's what I'm asking everybody to do. Uh, how many do we get so far? Uh, I think last time I checked here, let me look real quick. I think we've had exactly three people respond so far, and I might uh, send out another notification. So right now we have four for Thursday or Tuesday. And one person for Saturday. Now it's two for Saturday. So I might put another announcement on telling people they can vote for more than one day. They don't need to just do one day. And the day mm -hmm. with the most, whatever day gets the most votes would be the day we would look at. And we might have an alternate too. Like if we, if we plan it for a Tuesday and nobody shows, that we move it to a, you know, the secondary day. But what I'd like to do is figure out, are we going to do it the first, second, or third, whatever day of the week we want to do it. And then try to stick to it every week or every month, you know what I mean? So it's a consistency. But all I know, it's good to have Luna Bell back. Yep. And she definitely looks good on a cut. Now we just need to get her a patch cut. She'll probably even look better in that. Right, so we're going so we're going up to your place next? Yeah, I think she's going to be crashing with me for a little while until she gets something herself for as long as she wants, basically. You know I got that extra house, basically. So. We ready to head up now, or do we want to do anything else? Yeah, it's ready to go. You too, Luna? You're probably jet-lagged. Yeah, she probably ride. You know, right with I'm you again. I'm just getting tired of hearing people complaining on the plane. <laughs> well, there's no plane here. You, you, you want to mess with me, Mister? Hmm. Oh, the local lost guy who thought he was big shot. He forgot who he was talking to. Oh, uh, yeah, they usually always forget shit. You I mean, there, at least there ain't no, no bunch of them, like, you know, they fucking, you just look at them, they start shooting at you for no fucking reason. Yep. You'd have problems with that. You got a helmet, Luna? I can't fit one with my hair. Uh, well, hopefully no cops will see us then. You know they're gonna pull us over. <laughs> well, well, in that case, let's... Boot. In that case, we can probably take the side roads then. Yeah, There's probably no be a good idea. Though. I'd 
Monica said they can kiss my boot. <laughs> well, I don't believe you're required to wear a helmet other than our by our law. I ain't going to the trouble of putting a helmet on my hair or what be it, 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 you ever tell a uh, hair to, uh, I'm not even going to get started with it. Have, have you seen my hair? I don't have a hair problem with helmets. You're preaching to the wrong man. Still, they can kiss my boot. Because I'll step on in their lips. Let's go they straight here, Dom. Helmet. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I don't even know if you're required to wear a helmet in the state. I don't remember anything being in the laws for that. Sure, I know they bother you about it, though. Yeah. Well, I mean, we've got it in our, our chapter policy, but I believe the vice president and president can make exceptions. The question is, do we want to go left or right on 68? Well, then we're, we're coming in the wrong way, so we got to go right. Well, we could also go straight and go through Grapeseed and then hit the highway for that short bit. Yeah, yeah, just go right. Or, well, whatever you think, I guess. I mean... Well, if we go, if we go left, we got to go through Polito, so let's go straight. Yeah, okay, let's do that. You okay? Yeah. Yeah. I'm good. How are you on gas? Uh, 49. Uh, let's stop at this gas station here. Careful. I don't trust those semi drivers. I don't either. They've got more than two wheels. Hey, buckface. What are you doing? I'm going to put you in a world of hurt. Why did I kick my bike? <laughs> Jeez, man. Y'all already having fun. Fuck sakes, man. He didn't do anything wrong to you. Yeah, he just punched. He did. Yeah. Pick up my glasses. Of course. Aviators. <laughs> no, we didn't do that. No, he he just passed out, got out of his truck and passed out. Local lost up ahead. Yeah, they usually run the... Yeah, they're Stab. gonna turn off at Stab City. Yeah. I mean, I guess we still got the range in the county if we really needed to do something in the county or my place.
Mm -hmm. The nice thing, the bad thing about my place is there's no bar. Or did you want to go to back way? Uh, yeah, you know what? That might be a good idea. Let's go that way to grape seed. Less likely to run the cops this way. I just heard two murder keys, so we probably might want to keep on moving. Uh, I wasn't planning on stopping. Yeah. They that don't look like they belong here. Yeah, let's, let's, let's try. Hopefully, they don't fuck with us, man, because I do not want to deal with any asshole. Mm -hmm. Well, just so you know, I am packing. I think all now. three of us are packing, so. Yeah, I'm packing. You're yeah, packing. She's packing. I, I, I get that, but you, you got to remember, I didn't do anything. No, you didn't. And we didn't do anything either. We're just self-defense. No, what I mean is, if anything goes down and I do help, I, mm -hmm. I didn't shoot. Yep. I don't have a weapon, if you know what I mean. Yep, I know what you mean. It's kind of stupid, though. For somebody, you know, with that... It was a stupid record long time ago. Very long time ago. You gotta go check, go to the courthouse and see if that's even still on your record. Oh, well, I checked. Once I went to the airport, they were like looking at me with all suspicious looking at me. Guess you're lucky they didn't call the cops on you. They, they wanted to. But they were, they were watching me. If I moved even one muscle, though, it was like. I'm guessing you had to check the firearm. Let's just say I have my, my, my ways. Mm -hmm. Wait a minute, don't we have a place up here too? Yeah, there's uh, the bo there's a uh, Ruby Ridge's bar up here, the o Oak Lone Oak or Oak something, but I don't know if he's actually opened it yet. I mean, we could use this place as a clubhouse up here. Yep, well, he already offered that, so. Oh, uh, we can ask him later then. So. Well, no, he already, he already told me we could. All right. I miss my old home. Yeah, is it still available, or...? I don't think so. I have to double check. I doubt it is.
Yeah, this, this place will be a little bit of a downsize from you. Hey, that had some lost history, you know? Mm-hmm. Yes, the cops are all busy tonight. I haven't seen a single one. Okay, he's coming. I thought I he got lost. I used to own that place. Yeah, I know. I don't know who owns that. Hey, do you know who owns that bar, that restaurant next door, across the street? Mm -hmm. Oh, no, I'm pretty sure someone owns that. I was just wondering if you knew who. Uh, no, I have no idea. If you want to save the keys for that, you can. I don't know if it's probably a good idea to leave it in the uh, sun like that, because, you know... Yeah, you hold on. on. I'm gonna, gonna... I'm gonna tarp the uh, car, truck car in case she needs it. And if you need a car, you can grab the keys for that one too. That way, if you need a mode of transportation till you get something, you got some. Just let me know if you take long. the bike, because I need to get my other one fixed. Yeah. So. It shouldn't take me long to get some vehicles. I figured. Just gotta look for a mechanic job. Well, like I said, we might do something at the shop. I don't know. So which place do you want to stay it, in? That it. one or that one? hell is this what something you have something on the ground oh no that's from the local pickup truck so did you could put something in the bed shit they really go all out with the high tech stuff mm-hmm so much downgrade sorry wow no, Wow. Hey, it's more, I have to house. Half the time I'm crashing at the clubhouse anyways. If I'm up in the city, I'm not coming all the way back down here to crash. I've got a I've got a room at the uh, clubhouse now at the garage. So if I'm not here, I'm down there. So I think I'm going to go to bed here in a little bit unless uh, you want oh, you guys wanted to do something else. I'm not really planning on doing anything else. So. That's what I figured. I figured Luna here is probably jet lag, so jet lag she probably needs to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Thing is, I don't know. Like, I think so much has changed. Yeah, a lot has changed. A lot changed when I got back in the state too. I don't know anybody. This is the owl. So, I don't know. Okay, folks, I'm gonna stop the screen there, and I'll catch you in the next one.